Take it easy, Chioma. You know it's not our making. Everything will be alright. Just believe in God. Hmm? If you ability to do what others are doing, Papa is enough torture. Chioma, you are the one torturing yourself. Get this behind you, and that is the kill. If you go on harboring this in your mind, I'm sorry. You may not even last up to 25 years. Stay strong, Thank you very much. Get money, buy Choma drugs. Eh? Today now on the 17th. And the month never end. It's still far. Hmm? And I'd already borrowed 5,000 from my Oga. I don't know if you borrow again. Oh God. What did I do? Make I deserve all this Wahala. Eh? God. Hmm. God help me. Help me.
Ibu Desa. problem before my exams um but I had to borrow money what okay <sighs> my own son begged for money in US no that I didn't beg for money I only borrowed some money that's what I did oh Ken 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 why did you just give me a second call or go to Mr. Lucas of the legal department at the World Bank why didn't you do that? Oh dear, there's no big deal to this. Everybody gets broke once, you know, one time or the other. Okay. It's no big deal. It doesn't matter, I'm just human, Dad. Okay, okay, okay. Pleasure is all mine. Yeah. And this is Del. She's the niece to the vice president. Yeah. Wow. Nice, nice to meet you. Thank you. I've heard so much about you. Oh, you heard nice things? <laughs> yes, of course. <laughs> <laughs> well, you guys are, uh, please sit down. Make yourself comfortable. And, um, please, what do I order for you guys? Well, whatever the doctor prescribes, I guess. Okay. In that case, I have to take a trip to Paris and probably I get something nice for you guys. <laughs> you have the ticket, so that shouldn't be much of a problem. <laughs> Good. Um, yeah. I'll be back. All right. All right. Make yourself comfortable. Okay. So, what do you guys He is so gorgeous. Sue, don't tell me you're tripping already. Of course I am. She's already becoming so possessive. Don't even go there, girl. Don't oh, even go man. near him. Please. You weren't exaggerating when you said he was really handsome. He is so well, I hope you girls are not going to fight with my brother. No, no, we don't have to fight. Oh, uh, Jen. Jen? Yes, please. Help me get this. Okay. Wow. Okay. Hi. 
Some cream for your bodies. Oh, really? Yeah. Um, nice. So why don't we make a toast to the new doctor in the house? Oh, really? All right. And the best brother I could ever have in this world. Yeah. <laughs> Cheers. 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 Yeah. Cheers. 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 So, now that you're back in Nigeria, I hope you're not going to restrict yourself to only Lagos because. Abuja is where it's really happening, I must tell you. Oh, really? Yeah. Mm, okay. Yeah. yeah. I'll try, I'll try not to. You just have to check it out. Try okay. it out. I'll see how it goes. Yeah, you have to. All right, we'll yeah. give it a shot. Don't worry, my brother is going to be everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> I guess so. It's going to be everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> This one, why you come back by this time? She ain't no problem. She ain't no problem. Dear Raphael Simon, with due respect, it has come to our notice that after warning you sev sev severally to control your sleeping habits while at work, you have persistently refused to adhere to simple instructions. As a result of that, your services as the security man of this company has been terminated. Hey! He begged you. Mommy, what is it? Is it about me? Daddy, what is it now? No, no, I don't understand. They suck me for work. Why? What did you do? That good man. She ain't not gonna collect the flat when she ain't give us to. But Papa Chioma, how you go for a workplace go there and sleep? Eh? The one where you they drink, sleep, drink, sleep for this house. He never do you. How you go for your workplace where they sleep, Pajama? When you get that little work, we just the manage take care for this house. Now, when you don't do that, what do we do? And hey, Pajama, which kind of hair like you can put up on my head? Pajama, I could just sit down there and they look at me. You go for your workplace, go they sleep. Hey, Pajama. Which can man be this? Which can man be this? So, I may not last till next year. Ah. Hey. Uh. Hey. Hey. Nechioma, why your face is looking like uh, this old in days people? Did you go to the market today? Papa Chioma, if I tell you what happened to me in the market today, uh -huh. you go pity me. Uh -huh. What did happen? These government people came home and they scattered everywhere for market. Nechioma, they scattered everywhere. Well, 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 why, why now? I don't know. They just the blue we were Hey wickedness day for this world too much oh. telling you 
Eh? People just get mine for back. Anyway, uh, as I they come for road, so I see one signboard. They say they are looking for a cleaner. Cleaner? Uh huh. Oh God. Apart from you, still continue to do that kind of job, eh? Oh God, eh? Since you marry me, oh. even before you marry me, sir, if it's no cleaning job, it's get man, eh? What is it? Oh. Eh? Mm. What did I do? What did I do? Why would they suffer like this? I now see how important education is. And I have the opportunity of going to school. Why are you crying? Nene, talk to me. I'm your friend. What's the matter now? I just got tired of this. I want to go back to the village. What kind of nonsense talk is that? Are you out of your mind? You want to go back to the village and do what? Why would I be out of my mind when my uncle beats me up every day? Why? Come on, Nene. It's the way of life I learned. Life is not a bed of roses, you know. It's a training. So my father said. I don't care about what is that. I don't care about my friend. What about your school? Are you going to abandon your school just like that? Because the uncle beats you up. So you just enter your final year in secondary school. And any mistake you make now will surely affect your very future. To her with everything I have made up my mind to do, honey, stand that way. Stand that way. Yes. And I've tried my best as a friend. This the village is good for you. It's okay now. Stop crying. It's okay. Ah. It's okay now. Ah. It's okay now. It's okay. Stop crying. And what is that supposed to mean? <laughs> Meaning? Mm -hmm. Do you ever give guys a breathing space? <laughs> no, I don't. In fact, people like you should not be given a single chance at all, if you know what I mean. <laughs> wow. He wants to talk of the devil. <laughs> Cindy. I guess I have to believe it. Just wait. You're such a coward.
Hello, Ken. Hi. I, um... Don't tell me you've forgotten so sorry. Cindy. James Brown. I'm so sorry. I it's don't okay. see you. So, what are you doing here? Can I, you eat? I just came to have a drink. Yes. Oh, okay. Um... Um, uh, you want to have something? Like food? No, I don't want to I'm watching my weight actually. Okay. A drink with you. Okay, great. A drink of stout. Okay. Um, waiter? Yes. Waiter? Yes, sir. Oh, uh, please come. Um, can I have a bundle of stout? Yes. For what? So, you now run your father's hospital, yeah? Well, just practicing what I write in school. Oh, really? Yeah. That's good. Well, if you ask me, I'll suggest, I mean, I think it would be better if you, you know, go into contracts and stuff. I think it would pay you better. And have all the people of this country flown abroad for treatment. But that doesn't really matter. I mean, there's money for such medical treatments. that make you a nice guy? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. Well, what did you read in school? Mass communication. Are you practicing? Um, not really. Like I said before, I'm into contracts mm. in Abuja. Mm. Yeah, that's what I do basically. Are you a smoke? Yeah. I must say, uh, I just think you should know it's not very healthy for you. See, like, in the hospital, we, we get all cases like that, you know, and... Uh, okay. Thanks for the education. Okay? Yeah. Well, I think I have to go now. Hey, what about your drink? No, don't worry about the drink. I'll finish it some other time. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Okay. Okay. Bye. All right, it's nice chatting with you. Yeah, me too. What are your assessments of the girls? Um, kind of below my standards. <laughs> Come on, be serious. How serious do you want me to be? How can you say that the sister to a governor and the vice president's niece are below your standard? How can you say that? My friends are not below your standard. 
I hope you're not getting to your, your usual ranting self. I'm yet to understand whether you went to school to read biblical theology or, or medicine, or probably you're just a voluntary eunuch without emotions. How oh, dare you talk to me like that? So, was that why you were bombarding her with all those unnecessary questions? You know what? Your friend is very disgusting. Really? Well, I don't think so. So, who do you want then? None of your business. And you know what? I'm sick of this conversation. Now get out of my sight. Shouting like a British soldier held hostage by Japanese warriors. How are you going to leave for house with people? Are you going to call shout? Nobody can answer you. <laughs> eh? Papa Shioma, mm. if you like say you don't they drink, you say you won't become drunk. Go and sit down, my friend. You want them to wait up for you till 1 a.m. until you come back from your drinking galop. They've all gone to bed. Anyway, I get good news for you. I wouldn't be your good news. Make you sit down first, make I tell you. Sit down. I'll sit down first. You see, as I go for Mama Chichi place, make I take one plus one. Ah, I see one of my friends. You can't help me get job for Chioma for supermarket. Oh. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Thank God. Right. Uh, Thank God. Do. So I can now rest. She don't the waka waka look for job. So she can help the family too. <laughs> Here now, make I bring your food, right? Thank you, thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh. Thank you. Oh. Thank you. 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 Thank is now it? that he has lost the election, he's looking for everybody. I call him to do our party, yes. our own party. Yes. <laughs> now he has lost, he's looking for how to settle. <laughs> I told Chief Adekunle that he will lose, but he thought I was joking. You see, you cannot win if you don't join the big party. <laughs> you should have joined a big party, but my mind, your mind, your party like us. <laughs> you will have won the election going. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, Chief Alando. Yonzuwa. <laughs> Kinga, that your soul is a true replicate of his father. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you very much, Alaji. Mm. Thank you very much. Oh, wow. You see, uh, I am not happy that uh, you have no rationale. Why my son who has crossed seven seas like us <laughs> should not marry a princess. <laughs> <laughs> you know what, Chief Orlando? It's really as a way of repeating itself. Yes. Your uncle married my auntie. That's correct. And now your son is about to marry my daughter. <laughs> you're right. You're right. You're right. You see, once you're born into a very rich family that has contact and connections, <laughs> you never can let it die. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. <laughs> Thank you for a befitting card. 
defeating birthday success card. Oh, success card. Um, who's it? your mother, father, brother? My sister. This is beautiful. Any other thing? I um this a card for an angel. An angel? Yes, an angel. Anything else? Uh, nothing. Um, okay, just then. just pay to the cashier. Thank you for your patronage, sir. You're welcome. Section. What's her name, please? Chioma. Chioma. Please, do you have a pen? Yes. Okay. Thank you. Have a nice day. Uh, your change, please. Oh, no, oh, no, please. Don't bother. No. Thank you very much. You are. Chioma? Yes? Please come home. I should call. Mama, I'm coming. What is it? I think you've landed yourself in a serious trouble. What trouble? I picked for the guy that just came here. He said I should give it to you. I've never met him. I don't know him. I haven't asked you anything. Are you just a shiva? Uh, he just gave it to me. And you collected? I don't know him now. <laughs> you only know people in one day. You're special to me. 
Have you ever done anything for him? No, Mama. I, I guess he wanted to appreciate my services. Chioma. Chioma. Don't betray your mother. Uh, Chioma, don't betray your mother. Um, Mama, if that is it, I'll, I'll go and return it to him. That will make you happy. No, my dear. That is not what I want. I only want you to be careful. Some men are dead devils. Hmm? Let me say, make you go give him a card back. Hmm? Go and wash off those clothes. Where you soak since morning? Okay, ma. Say you look radiant. Thank you. <laughs> you want to get something? Um, not exactly. Is she out? Yes, but you can't see her. Hold on, she gave me something to give to you. Okay. That's nice. Ooh, la la. Okay. This is the cardboard for her. Why? Yes, she said she does not want it. You see, I, I want to say this. I bought this card. From my heart, it was a spontaneous thing. I, I know things have been sort of crazy. And I know your friend might think um, some funny things. See, I'm a medical doctor. I mean well. I don't have any negative intentions towards a friend. Like I said, I know it sounds crazy, but I just want to know who she is. Sometimes things in life happen like that. It sounds crazy, but as the truth, I just want to know her. You know, sometimes you come one on one with your destiny and walk past her. Somehow you find yourself coming back to it. This is a case I don't want to. I don't know. It sounds crazy, but the truth, what I'm trying to say here is I really mean well for your friend. Just help me, please. Help me talk to her. I'm not looking for a good time. I just wish you can see my heart. Please help me. Just help me talk to her. Help me give this back to her, please. It's okay, I'll do that. Thank you. Please, I can, I want to show you. You will regret it. It's okay. Thank you very much. All right, bye-bye. Have a nice day. Yeah. Emergency world. 
What's wrong with him? The doctor is dead. Dead? Yes, doctor. He died a few minutes ago. <sighs> Wasn't Dr. Fred here to attend to him? My friend is not at home. What about Dr. Iwanya? I think he had a flu. Jesus Christ. Have you consulted the man's family? We haven't done anything. We've been waiting for you to come. All right, do that right away. Some men are blind sometimes. They don't look before setting out on a journey. If I tell him who I am, he will run 100 meters in 6.10 seconds. Or does he think I can just fall for any man like that? Anyway, I know what to do. I'll just tell him off outrightly so that he will learn to keep off from me. I'm off to the hospital now. It's all right, it's all right. But uh, remember, we have a date with Alaji Dagash and his daughter tomorrow. Tomorrow? Yes, tomorrow. A any problem? I just think it's rather abrupt. Well, Daddy, the truth is, he has found love somewhere else. My friend, shut up. Dad, I just think we need to postpone this. Especially knowing there are so many patients in the hospital to attend to. Okay. Are you saying that uh, what she has just said now is correct? Daddy, the girl is not bad at all. She's the sister to the governor of Kwara State. Her name is Singh. Daddy, you like her with... Ruth, shut up! Shut up! Keep quiet! You're talking rubbish. Whether her name is Cinder or Cinderella, or is the sister to the governor or commissioner, I don't care! Don't take not in my house will my own son dictate to me who he will marry. Not in this house! It's all right. Dad, you're shouting. Yes, I'm shouting. And I'll keep on shouting and shouting and let no one provoke me in this house. Dad, you know Jane. She has a way of setting on fire. Hey, please spare me and don't insult me. Uh -uh. Jane, have you forgotten that he's your elder brother? Dad, Dad, I just think you need to reconsider this. I'm late for the hospital. Hey, just go to wherever you want to go. But what I have said is final. Nobody will change that. Have a nice day, sir. See you, everybody. Bye, Daddy, she's my friend. Sir, sure, sir. Sure. Chioma? Chioma? Yes? Please, come. Yes? I want you to stay here for me. Let me just go back and sit down. Please, you're going to let Did you return my, my car? Please, young man. It took me a year to get this job, which sustains my family. And if you think you can just come around me and make me lose my job, you must be joking. So just go. Don't you just get it? Can't you sense when you're, you're, you're not needed around someone? Can't you sense it? Leave me alone. Choma. 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 Please go. But I want you to remember that 
have a date with us. Let me be. She could take jam. I know be say she know they pass. She cannot continue like this. Half education is dangerous, so. Uh, but uh, we have tried our best now. I don't have money. Eh? You know we have tried and tried. I don't talk my own. Half education is dangerous. Don't talk my own. Who is that? Yes, can I help you? Uh -uh. Let the man in first now. Okay. Young man. Sir. Who are you and uh, what do you want to see? My name is Dr. K. I'm um, here to see Choma. Oh, I see. Sit down. Thank you, Sida. Uh -huh. Can we get you something? Um, soft drink, would you? <laughs> Thank you very much, man. <laughs> uh, it's like uh, you are the new doctor, eh? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Uh -huh. Hey, Chioma! Chioma! Yes, Papa! Come on. <clears throat> Oh, oh, doctor, um, what a pleasant surprise. Really nice to see you. Um, this is my father, and I'm sure you've met my mom. My younger ones went out, they're not around. Um, I meant coming over to see you, but I, daddy, um, doctor is a very busy man and he won't like to stay for long. Huh? What? You know your doctor better. <laughs> All right, doctor. It's really nice meeting you. Oh, that's my idea. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you very much. Sir. All right. Thank you very much. We'll see you next time. Bye bye. Uh, say bye to mommy. All right. What did you do that for? Don't come back here again. I, um, I must say that I don't particularly like people who express such attitude. I don't care what you like and what you don't like. Just don't come back here again. Please, for heaven's sake, leave me alone. How do you give me my address? I'm afraid I can't tell you that. Where is the doctor? I don't understand. He said the doctor is a very busy man, so maybe next time. But well, he said he wanted a soft drink. Well, no problem. Maybe some other time. Hmm? Okay, just whatever. Just go, please. Go. Mm -hmm. Just go, please. Girl who want to ruin my son's life. You? You are stupid. Have you not agreed to get away from my son's life? What stupid son are you talking about? Who the hell is your son? 
I am sure that you are aware that nobody knows your name. And you shouldn't worsen in your case, otherwise... Otherwise what? What can you do? What the hell can you do? Five million naira, and you get out of my son's life. <laughs> Five million naira. She can change. My brother, the governor, gives me one million naira every single week. And there you are offering me five million to stay away from your son. How am I supposed to endure that all my life? Well, I guess your son is not even worth it after all. How dare you talk to me like that? I don't care who your brother or your father is. I don't care. If I decide to waste you here, I will do that right here. And nobody will query me. I can waste you here now. Spider, so. Tada! Just leave me alone now. Please, don't you ever give up? No. Oh, please, I'm begging you now, leave me alone. Well, since you have refused to accept me now, I hope you accept this little gift for me. I don't want your gift. Please, just go. Just, just, please, just, go. Okay. Leave me. Please, okay, I know, I know you're not happy, but I'm happy knowing you. You're the only genuine person I've met in a long, long time. Please just give me some audience. I don't want to listen to you. Just go. Please go! 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 Happy birthday. Many happy returns. Just go, go away. about you. He knows how wretched you are. He knows all about your family. So why don't you just give him a chance? I hate rich people. They make me sick. Wrong language. If you hate rich people, that means you don't want to be rich. It's not their making that they are rich or vice versa. Just give him a chance. So what do I do? Nothing. Just go to Queen's restaurant by 8.30. He's taking you out for dinner. How much did he pay you? Look, Chioma, you're my best friend. I wouldn't let you lose what belongs to you. Why don't you just go first? If you don't like him, then you can go your way. 
Just give him a chance, please. Out, I came back by 11 p.m. and I overslept. I was dreaming I overslept. Ah. So you started sleeping and overdreaming? See, that guy is a nice guy. Mm. So, so you went? <laughs> I went to come and see how he was treating me like one queen like this. Eh? Uh. <laughs> eh? So did he do? Did he what? Did he now? Did he what? Please, he's a gentleman. He's not like that. He is a gentleman. Are oh, you sabi? Don't forget that every woman needs a man. Are you sabi? Every woman needs a man. Go. Good morning, ma. Good morning. Why did you decide to come to work today, uh, Madam, I... I... You have not finished sleeping, my dear. Go back home. When you finish sleeping, come back to work. Now he's not. See, well, let me tell you what Go happened. Go back there. home, please. Oh, please, now, please. I will come. Come to your office. Okay. Hey, God, Diana, please. Check and see what Ken has caused. There are trouble. No, worry. just go, okay? I'll talk to her on your behalf. Okay, I'll talk to her. Daddy, good afternoon. Uh, uh, good afternoon. Uh, uh, dog, 
Uh, uh, you are welcome. Uh, do sit down now. Thank you very much. Uh, sit down. Thank you. Uh, Thank you. How is mommy? Welcome. Very fine, sir. <laughs> how is uh, how is mommy? Uh, she's inside. Uh, next, your ma. Hello. Come on, come and greet the uh, doctor. <laughs> Come and greet the doctor. Ah, doctor. Ah, good afternoon, ma'am. Ah, doctor. You're welcome. Thank you very much. Ma. How was your day? Very fine, ma'am. You're welcome. Thank you. I'll get him something to drink now. Doctor, what can I get for you? Any soft you do, ma'am. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Right. Okay. okay. Come, is the food ready? It will be ready in 10 minutes. Follow up so that the doctor can uh, test our food. <laughs> ah, my dear young man, you know, say, me, I'm a man. And uh, when you see a man, they go closer, they come closer, they follow woman. You can not say maybe. Maybe <laughs> <laughs> something. I understand. I understand where you're coming from, sir. Uh -huh. I I like to say that um, I mean well for your daughter. Mm -hmm. And I'm really here to stay. Mm -hmm. And pretty soon, my. My family will be here uh, to meet you formally. Uh, ah, that will formally. be lovely. <laughs> I, uh, I, uh, I strongly believe that um, uh, things should be done in the open. Uh, and I must right. say this, uh, you have an exceptional daughter. Oh, I like what you just said. <laughs> she's one, <laughs> I must say she's one in a billion. So. Uh, God, God bless you. <laughs> Thank uh, you, sir. Nechoma, huh? is the food not ready? Very soon. I'm hurrying now so that the doctor can at least test our food. Wow. <laughs> it's my way. Oh, you're woke. Well, the, it's, it's okay. It's okay. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, but I must say, there's, there's so much, um, there's so much poverty in the land, you know, so much sickness. You know, but um, I know with time things will get better. Cindy, you disappoint me. In fact, I'm so disappointed in you. I mean, Cindy, how could you have been bought so cheap? Oh, oh Jane, please cut all that trash out. Please cut it out. How could you? Jane, will you please just stop ranting and spare me all this? I was not bought, okay? How many times do you want me to say it? You okay? were not bought. You were not bought. Look at you telling me you were not bought. You sit down there to tell me you were not bought. Five million naira to leave my brother alone. And then you sit out here to tell me you were not bought. Jane, please, will you stop this rubbish? I did not collect money from your father. Your father offered to give me five million naira. And I told him off very, very well. Okay? So you mean you did not take the money? Like, like hell, I did not collect it. I mean... Your brother is obviously worth only five million naira to your father. What a shame. And your lousy father even had the guts to Excuse slap you. Excuse me. Please don't insult my father. Please. You guys should just leave me alone. Thank God I didn't even bother. I mean, right now I can't even come close to you or your brother or any of you because you're beginning to piss me off. And even, I detest you guys so much right now. I can't even come close to you. That's about marrying him. It's all trash because you leave me to hell alone. Stay the hell out of my life. Nonsense! Nonsense! I can't stay here in my house and be dictated by my own son on what to do. I can't! You must go to Elijah Dagas to marry the daughter. You must go there! He will go. Just give him some time. What an insult! What an insult, Nancy! Because I'm busy, that's why he thinks that he can do anything. You have been a medical director does not mean that you're a full grown-up man. Dad, you're becoming overbearing. Do you hear me? Did you hear the insult again from your son? Dad, I, I thought you sent me overseas to, to, to gain wisdom and knowledge so as not to be pushed around by anybody. Isn't that what you asked me to do? Yes! Then, then why are you trying to push me around, Dad? Why? I'm trying to make you realize that weight of this nation revolves around the rich only. Oh, so I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry that, that, that I found joy somewhere unexpected, somewhere unpopular, and I don't want nobody coming between me and that joy. And I mean it, Dad. I will cut short that here joy. Did you hear that, Mom? You cut short my joy because of some Tim Dagash and, and his daughter. Listen, Dad. That ain't right. I will stand for that. 
No way! God damn it! No way! No, excuse me, Dad. God damn it! This is the answer. You were rather too harsh on him. You shouldn't have spoken to him. Nancy! 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 Talk to your son! Bring him back to his senses before I do something drastic. Do you hear me? Talk to your son, Nancy! Give me the decrease. Thank you. Oh, hi. Hello, my love. How are you? I'm not fine. What's the matter? I'm being sucked. Provisions for you to write jam again. All I want you to do is concentrate on your books. I mean, I mean, concentrate on you as well. Thank you very much. Henceforth, I'll take care of all your needs with, with your families. Thank you very much. Your Jara was still looking like somebody that's in detention. <laughs> you know, those guys don't know your value. You know what you like? What? Like all the oil in the world? No, no, no. Yes. All the gold? No. The gold is not enough. You know, you're priceless. And you're like the rising sun. Bringing its radiance to the faces of people like me. Respect? What's wrong with you? Respect? For who? This got a girl? Is something wrong with you? Hey, hey, where do you think you're going to? Don't you dare go anywhere. Why don't you tell him? You're looking at me. Why don't you just tell him that you're a sickler?
sent me overseas to, to, to gain wisdom and knowledge so as not to be pushed around by anybody. Isn't that what you asked me to do? Yes! Then, then why are you trying to push me around, Dad? Why? I'm trying to make you realize that weight of this nation revolves around the rich only. Oh, so I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry that, that, that I've found joy somewhere unexpected, somewhere unpopular, and I don't want nobody coming between me and that joy. And I mean it, Dad. I will cut short that here joy. Did you hear that, Mom? You cut short my joy because of some thief Dagash and, and his daughter. Listen, Dad. That ain't right. I will stand for that. No way. Don't dare me. No way. Uh, no, excuse me, Dad. Don't dare me. This is dear, so you were rather too harsh on him. You shouldn't have spoken to him. Then. Nancy. Nancy. Talk to your son. Bring him back to his senses before I do something drastic. 
Give me Dr. Chris. Thank you. Oh, hi. Hello, my love. How are you? I'm not fine. What's the matter? I've been sucked. Provisions for you to write jam again. All I want you to do is concentrate on your books. And me. And me concentrate on you as well. Thank you very much. Henceforth, I'll take care of all your needs. I mean, with your families. Thank you very much. Now, Jara will stop looking like somebody that's in detention. <laughs> you know those guys don't know your value. You know what you like? What? Like all the oil in the world? No, no, no. That's all the gold? No. The gold is not enough. You know you're priceless. And you like the rising sun? Bringing its radiance to the faces of people like me. You might tell me. You might drink it. Ken, mm -hmm. there's something else I'd like to let you know. It's very I don't important. Know. Honey, that should wait some other time. Please, you must listen to. Uh, hi! Hi, Jane. How you doing? Oh, that's my younger sister, Jane. Jane, here is Choma. Oh. That woman. Choma. I finally meet the gold digger. What did I hear you say? Can you show some respect? What's wrong with you? Respect? For who? This got a girl? Is something wrong with you? Hey, hey! Where do you think you're going to? Don't you dare go anywhere. Why don't you tell him? You're looking at me. Why don't you just tell him that you're a sickler? What? Are you dumb? Can't you talk? What? Tell him! Tell him it's not true, Jim. Of course it's true. Oh, shut up! Choma! 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 Oh, leave her, she's gone. Who told you she's a sickler? Doesn't matter who told you. Who told you she's a sickler? It doesn't. Look, if you don't tell me right now, I'm going to do something very bad. Oh, why don't you just go ahead? I mean, tell me, what do you do with such a girl? A school dropout? A disgusting pig? And most annoyingly, a sickler? I mean, what are you doing with her? You shouldn't let that hear of this.
This is not my world And why am I this way? Something must be wrong, I think All I feel is pain Oh, I wish you know You know the way I feel Deep inside my heart I cry All I ask is why <sighs> My sister cried. Why? God, why? Why is she crying? Why? Who is crying? Mama, his sister, his, his sister Choma, she came back just now crying. I answered what was wrong with her. She did not answer me. So, where is she? She has gone into her room. Choma! Choma!
Ay, ay, ay. This is not my world, and why am I this way? Something must be wrong, I think. All I feel is pain. Oh, I wish you know, you know the way I feel. Deep inside my heart, I cry. All I ask is why. <laughs> wow, this is beautiful. I know. Just a card from an angel. An angel? Yes, an angel. <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> Just leave me here. Please, don't you ever give up. <laughs> Do I have a hope? A hope to live or die? Feel this pain deep down my soul. Deep inside my heart Who is there for me? A lonely wretch in me Times I wish to sleep away Sleep forevermore Go! Happy birthday Who is that? It's me. Ma. Yes. Do not blame me so if you were in my shoes. No, what is it now? You're supposed to be asleep. I don't want to sleep. Sister, why are you not happy? Ma, please lie down and sleep, okay? But you said trouble doesn't make people sleep. Are you troubled? You are, sister. Tell me what's your problem. Why have you decided not to talk to anybody? Ma, it's your uncle. Uncle Ken. What about him? He will soon leave me. Why? Doesn't he love you again? He has found out I'm a sick love. Is that why you've been crying? But you should have told him earlier. Yes, you're right. I should have told him earlier. Well, it is over now, so just go to bed, okay? But you promise me you won't cry again. Mm -hmm.
this pain Oh, I wish you know, you know The way I feel deep inside my heart I cry Sorry, ma. sorry for what? Eh? How you come break my, my, my precious daughter's heart? She not tell you say she no wants any heartbreaker. Huh? I've come here to see her, please. I've come to see her. So that you can deceive her with your money. Please can I see her? For what? May I ask? Let the young man be. Leave her make it come enter. I'm really sorry, ma. I'll make it up. Please. I'm really sorry. Just don't misunderstand me. Let the young man be. Yeah, sir. Okay, sit down. Thank you, sir. Please, uh, can I... Can I see Chum? You know? Go and call Chum for him.
She said you don't go ever come out again. to crave your indulgence. I'd like to take her out of place. If only that will make her happy. You can go. Thank you. Walked in. Are you sure there are no more? I mean, no more secrets. No more secrets. Are you sure? Yes. Oh. 
Then who is she? When I got back last night, you two had gone to bed. That does not answer my question. Who is this pig you brought into my compound? There, there's no pig here. She's my friend. What? <laughs> Did I hear you right? You heard me, Dad. I've said it. I said that one day this boy will kill me. No, leave all that. Leave that to me now. Young woman, come for. Let me see your face. See your face. Sir. Who are you and what are you to my son? My name is. <clears throat> my name is Choma and I. I. She's my friend. I'm his friend. My friend, shut up. What's good with that thing? That, that is not necessary. As a matter of fact, I'm on call at the hospital. There's an emergency. So please, let's leave this, this question for some other time. Oh, yes, I will do exactly that. Thank you, Dad. Yes. Young woman, come, come, so you can hear me very well. Young woman. Sir. I don't want to see you step into this compound again. Yes, sir. Don't you ever come here. Do you hear me? Yes, sir. Now, now get out. That was harsh. That was really harsh. You don't treat human beings like that. That's a human being for Christ's sake. I told you your son was mad. He's crazy. That's your son. Spider! Spider! Sir, come here. I don't want to see that girl step into this compound again. Do you hear me? Nonsense. Oh, 
I'm really, really, really sorry. Please, please, I don't want to cry, please. I'm really sorry, please. I thought you was going to come to this, didn't I? I'm so sorry. Okay? I'm really sorry. My father is such a hate man. Okay? Anyway, you're getting married to me and not my father, so don't worry about it. He wasn't just a threat. He meant every word he said. Okay. An idea. I'm gonna go rent an apartment somewhere that's just gonna be for you and I. That way you and I can have some peace. All right? Okay. All right, honey? Okay. I'm really sorry. Okay? All right, guys. Again. Mommy, 
Something has to be done urgently. That girl has turned his head. And who is this stupid girl that has turned my son's head against the family? Who is she? Or was it the girl that came in here with him the other day? I don't know. All I know is the so-called girl is the school dropout. Her mother, a petty trader. And her father, one dirty cleaner like that. Oh my God, my God. My enemies will definitely laugh at me. Why should Glenn do this to me? You see how blind your brother is? The worst thing is, the so-called girl is anemic. Jesus. What? That is why I said something has to be done urgently. You are right. And that thing must be done immediately. I must do something. My son must not face this. Spider! Spider! I really think you, you ought to do it that way. Please keep me posted. Okay. Bye bye. Chimami. Cham cham. Are you alright? What is it? Nothing. What is it? Are you alright? Yeah. What is it? Are you okay? I'm fine, yeah. Mm -hmm. Just a change in my system. Are you right? Yeah. Yeah. You look stressed. Are you okay? <sighs> oh, God. What is it? I've been removed as the medical director of the hospital. Why? I don't know. Oh, my God. What are we going to do? I think we need to move overseas. I mean, we need to leave this country. How? My family, what about? What will happen to them? We'll send money to them from time to time. They believe you. The flat you promised them, nothing has come out of it. Well, that's sheer nonsense. Oh, please. I'm oh, sorry. Damn it. Ken, I'm sorry. I said I'm sorry now. I'm sorry. I saw the two of them at the American Embassy, but they did not see me. Are you sure of what you see? Yes. Are you very sure? That I am very sure. That will never happen. It should that happen. will never happen in my house. Happen, no. That will, will just... never happen. Spider! Spider! Sir. Sir, I have to postpone my trip to Abuja. I have a very important and urgent assignment for you, and it must be carried out now. Yes.
So, you are the father of the sick girl that has bewitched my son? I know they talk to people who take masks, cover their face. So I can tell you now. Spider. Son. Now wait in now. What is your name? Now he make your people just force me to make I come here. I said, what is your name? What do you want from me now? Will you shut up and answer that question? Come on! My name is Rafael Noah. Alas Mount. Well, it doesn't matter whatever your name is. What is your sick daughter doing with my son? Now your son. Now you go ask. What did him they do with my precious daughter? Do you know that if you die here, I will bury you? And nobody will know that you existed. I will bury you here. Make I tell you, me, I go prefer to die than make I go the pop nose for waiting no concern me and my daughter. Will you shut up? Shut up! Eh, uh, it's all right. Um, Mr. Ruff, see, let me give you one or two million naira and if you are sick daughter, you will certainly leave my son alone. Or you will die in detention here starving. <sighs> Let's say you never know me. Oh. Make I just tell you, that one no go move me on. People there will be saved, they hear death. They go, they run, they run, they run, they run. And people there ready, where they say, they feel ready to die between today and tomorrow. And me are ready for people where go die today. You are crazy. You are very crazy. You are crazy. <sighs> Mr. Rafa. Eh? I ask you for the last time. Take the money. Just go and get a new house. Live a new life. See, just imagine yourself. Take the money. Then you, you can now relax and enjoy yourself. So, now that one, now you go bring my daughter happiness. Huh? You are stupid. You are a very foolish man. Spider! Sir! You've not seen anything. Let's get to the inside. Okay, I'm waiting. Yeah. 
Ben 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 Inside. That will not be a problem. I enter house. Ah, one make of pass out. Ah, Ralph, you understand? Ah, I will just take back here. Yeah. Enter my room. Papa, yeah. no go see me. Pass out. I know what will be your problem. Mm. Oh, take oh. this one. Just take this one. Mellow down. Eh? Yeah. Ralph, 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 Ralph. Yeah. Then I feel enter house now. See, that woman away. That will money for you. A fine woman. <laughs> Ralph, Ralph. Yeah. Promise me, say if, if you okay. don't marry, I'm born picking. You're picking, you marry my picking. Now, what do you want with that? No problem, you're picking, you marry my picking. All right, now make I enter house. Eh? Promise. I promise. No, no. And baby. name true mod moreover we cannot afford to have a sickler as a wife in the house you know what what i don't understand is don't you want me to be happy i do ken i do that is why i want you to marry a better woman she is the better woman for me i've been with her it can make me happy that girl is I just don't know how, how to express it. She is excitement. She's everything to me. Listen, I, I just have this funny feeling that if I don't have that girl, my life would do it. Besides, I'm AA. My genotype is AA. I can marry an SS or AS. My genotype is capable of marrying an SS person. So it's not a problem. You understand? Assuming I'm AS and she's AS now or, or SS, then it's, it's a problem. But I am AA, so there's no problem. Listen, Jane. Okay? Listen, this girl and I, our body and soul are joined together. Listen, you just need 10 minutes with that girl and you might be changed for Oh, oh, oh. What is it, Ma? Why are you crying? <laughs> Again, yesterday, I took my husband. We have not seen him since that yesterday. Who took him away? I don't know them. <laughs> Where's Chamama? Chama. You mean Chama is not around? <laughs> mommy, mommy. Oh, you know, this is my daughter. Calm down, please. Just calm down, please. <laughs> mommy, please just calm down. Listen, mommy. My daughter. Don't worry. Chioma is very, very all right. And we'll find daddy, okay? Okay? Give me a few moments. Let me make some calls, okay? No, I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you. Okay, let's go. Let's you must remind my daughter. Okay, no problem. Let's go. Where's your key? You. Where's your key? Okay, 
Come on. Good afternoon. Where's Dad? Where's Dad? What is it again, son? Oh, so you still remember that you had father? Mom, where is Dad? Yeah, okay. So, what is the matter? What is it? Dad? Yes. Dad? You have 10 minutes. 10 minutes to produce my wife and my father in the morning. <laughs> Uh, Again, I can see that you've lost your manners. Yes, I have lost my manners. I have lost my manners. A leopard begets a leopard. Now, Dad, produce my wife and my father-in-law. Yes! So what will you do? Oh, Dad, you're not going to like what I'm going to do. You're not going to like what I'm going to do. Where's my wife and my father-in-law? <laughs> well, that could be very difficult because she's far away. As for your father-in-law, not my own in law, I know nothing about his whereabouts. You're kidding. And you know you're lying, Dad. Where is my father-in-law and my wife? I'm not kidding, son. Oh, Dad, you dare it! Dad, you dare me, your Dad! My father has gone to get you a, the choicest woman to marry. See, you will love her. You the girl is very good to the family. You know, I'm just happy that I know that my son will come back to his senses. Senses? What senses, Dad? What senses? That I should go marry some, some whatever I don't know? Dad, I don't know. You're not the same dad I used to know. What's, what's going wrong here? What's going wrong, Dad? We, this, this is not the dad I used to know. Oh, God. Please, Release my daughter and my husband. And I promise you. I promise you will never come near your family. Who is this uh, market woman coming to disturb my peace? I bet you. She's my stand up. Stand up. Don't need her. Don't need her. Don't need her for nobody here. Who are you? I'm the mother of Gemma. And Ralph is my husband. What is your name? Nene. 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 You? Nene, can't you recognize me? Nene, look at me closely. It is me, Adugo. Your Nancy. Adugo. Nene. Adugo. 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 Nene. Adugo. Nene. Stop all this now. Stop this nonsense now. Stop it. Stop the nonsense. Yes, sir. Get me that girl I got for my son to marry. Bring her here. Yes, sir. Now, what girl? I won't marry anybody. I'm not going to marry her, Dad. You will. I want my wife. And you must. No, Dad. I'm not going to marry her. You must marry her. Oh, okay. Go ahead. Bring, bring whoever. Bring, okay. bring her. No problem. No problem. Let's see how I'm going to marry her. To be my loving daughter. You, Jen! Daddy, I was tired of hurting my brother. I mean, this is not taking us anywhere. It's only keeping my brother far from me. Spider! Get me the father of this girl here! Bring him here! Okay, sir. Now! Daddy, Ken cannot continue to suffer this injustice. 
Moreover, Choma is expecting his baby. What? She's pregnant? Since, since his genotype is AA, he's free to marry Choma even though she's a sickler. Against me? Why are you people against me in this house? Why is everybody against me? Why? You say man proposes and God disposes. The events of recent has shown me that uh, we always have one lesson to learn. I'm an old man. And Mr. Ralph, you are a kind man to me. I remember that day I was joking with you. And I did promise that my son will marry a daughter. We were very happy, and you left. But I, I don't understand you. Yeah, this is that young Ikenna. Ikenna Orlando. She was my father's kid. Ikenna! My Ikenna! Oh, oh God. Eh? Why, 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 why they do me like this now? Eh? Eh? What do I do you? Why you can't they do me like this? Akura, I'm sorry. I want you to forgive me. I apologize to you. I'm a human being. Please, I'm sorry. Uh, Ken. Please arrange for the wedding immediately. Thanks, Daniel. Let me get all the information about the wedding. Please. Thank you, Dad. Thank you, Dad. No, I disagree. I disagree because I want to know how far I will go with the pregnancy. If I survive, then we'll marry, but if I don't, we'll marry your choice. Oh, no, your no. my baby. Please don't say things like this. Trust in God. You will surely survive. Like they say, good things don't come easy. I promised my parents I was going to make them happy before I died. It's going to be like this. You're talking about it. You're going to be alive. You're not going to die. You're going to be okay. The baby's going to be okay. Your mom, your dad, my parents, my sister, we're all going to be fine. We're all family. Yeah.
she'll be all right. She'll be okay. Yeah. She'll be all right. She'll be all right. She'll be all right.